we all know in the Pacific the main challenge is isolation. They are away from all the happenings in the world and the always is challenge to bridge that gap. And ICT is modern in the modern world is like transportation in the previous decades. So it connects people, it helps the countries to move information across other countries and it helps growing their business, develop new opportunities for employment, social services would be getting benefited. Being an isolated island and uh, limited on resources, uh, let alone the access from the outside world and the resources on hand, there's a bit of a challenge there to coordinate it all. To say that there isn't processes and bureaucracy that needs to be followed, it would be incorrect. You have to understand how to work with the banks, you have to understand how to work closely with the governments and I think ADB does a wonderful job in, in bridging between the people that are building the cable and the people who are buying the cable. This uh, telecom uh uh, advancement uh, is, has been and will always be a critical component uh, of our sustainable development. And we also celebrate the results of uh, public-private partnerships, uh, how people can come together, really create the necessary foundations for uh, nations like Palau to continue to grow. Everything that we do and in, in, in within the Republic um, is uh, tied to one thought, and that is education leads to success. With the uh, improved uh, connectivity, the possibilities are immense. Uh, we can collaborate uh, not just within the region, but also outside of the region. Uh, people in the states who doesn't uh, see the effect of climate change have a chance now to uh, partner with the classrooms and talk about it.